Hi, my name is Chrissy and this is a tiny bookcase and I like to welcome you to my channel. Um, today I wanted to share with you um, an unboxing of Coffee in the Classic. Um, I just got the box today so I'm quite excited to get into it. Um, this is the children's book box so it will be the children's selection but there is also an adult selection and um, you can kind of switch between either one. Um, all you have to do is go into your account and if you decide that month you want to get um, the other box, you can just make those changes to your account as long as it's before um, around the time when they start shipping out. I believe it's like the second week of the month. I'm not exactly sure. so. Um, you might want to check on that, but usually by the end of the month, um, around, I'm sorry, I'm going all over the place, um, around the 5th, 14th of the month, they will give you a sneak peek, usually, um, what's going to come in the next month's box. So usually by the end of that month, you want to get those changes done so that when they're going to ship out, you'll get the correct box. But um, I do get the, um, I don't want to try to say it's the stand, no, it's not the standard box. What is it? It is the starter box. That's what I get, the starter box. So I get the starter box, and I believe that's $41.95, but I will check on it, and I will leave the price in the description below. Um, and in that box, you receive um, the book, two bookish items, a beverage, and a bookmark and it's pretty um i think that's pretty good for the price um it is a little i mean it is a little pricey compared to some book boxes but um for the most part i enjoy this box so um i'm fine with that um the starter box is a little bit more um it is 50 four dollars i think i'll have to check on that one because i don't receive it but it's a little bit more, and with that box, you get everything I just described in the starter box, but it will also come in a photo box, and it will also include a mug and a snack, as well as all the items I mentioned in the starter box. So, um, you do get extra items for the price that you put them, the higher price. It is also includes shipping, so your shipping is included in that price. Um, and again, I will leave the prices in the description box so that you can see for yourself if you're interested and you can check out the website. Um, so let me get this open and give you a sneak peek of the box. And here's a sneak peek. Let's see. And that's your sneak peek. So you get a card and it'll give you the items that come in this box and there's usually some kind of illustration. This has Green Gables in the corner and if you know and of Green Gables you kind of know what is, well I don't know did I mention what's coming in this box this month? This month's selection is Anne of Green Gables. It is one of my favorite books. Um, I love the Anne of Green Gables series. I've read most of the series. Um, I think I might have skipped some books here and there. Um, and it has been quite some time since I read the book, so my memory is a bit foggy on some of the, um, the, what happens in the book. But, um, this box is going to contain the very first first book in that series which is Anne of Green Gables and I was so excited when I found out that this was going to be the book selection this month. I used to have a copy of this book and I gifted it um, away so um, I didn't have a copy and actually it was kind of um, interesting. I was actually looking um, for a copy of Anne of Green Gables around the time the sneak peek came up and uh, we learned that the selection for the children's classics was going to be Anna Green Gables and I was so excited because like I said I was looking for a copy 
and it just so happens that that was this month's selection. So it was, it was just, just I was, I got lucky, I guess. So I was really happy about that. Now the adult box, um, that selection would, was going to be, or is, um, a tree gross in Brooklyn. I love that book as well. It's, a favorite of mine by Betty Smith um but I own a copy of A Tree Grows in Brooklyn although my copy is a bit battered it's well loved and I've had it for many years um so I <laughs> wouldn't have mind minded uh, receiving that book box as well but I'm on a budget so I could only get one and I chose Anne of Green Gables so without further ado <laughs> Let's get into the box. So I'm gonna put the card aside and it's a really pretty card. And I'm gonna go through these squiggly things. And the first item I'm taking out of the box is this little cute tote. It's, it's just a little tote and really pretty color. It has a quote, Dear Cold World, she murmured, you are very lovely and I am glad to be alive in you. Lucy Maud Montgomery, Anna Green Gables. So that's cute. I can do something with that. Okay, and the next item I'm pulling out is, what is this? So here's a little look at that. And this is, it's ever so much easier to be good if your clothes are fashionable. <laughs> And Shirley. Oh, okay. So this is a magnet set. So it's kind of like a take, I guess, on paper dolls. So there you have Anne Shirley. And then you have some outfits and some accessories. And I suppose that you could kind of dress her up. Or you could just use these individually. Let's take a peek at them. I hate opening things when... Oh, I knew that was going to happen. I tore it a little bit. Okay, let's take out these magnets. So here is Anne. Oh, I'm covering her face. Here's Anne. And here is an outfit. So, oop, it sticks pretty good. Here's an outfit. So that's neat. That's, I mean, if you were ever into paper dolls, I mean, I think you'd get a kick out of that. But I think this is cute. So there's one outfit down. And here is her. Oh, she love this. Her puff sleeves dress. So if you know the series, you know a lot about this dress. So, oh, she adores this dress. And then you also get some accessories. So this is a book and a carpet bag and a bonnet or so straw hat. So those are cute. I really like, I really like this. And um, I love it. Um, the the way you can you know can put them together and play with that or you can just use them as magnets so that's really neat and it's a really cute little envelope that comes in so that's the second bookish item so there's a beverage before we get into the um book let's check out the beverage so this is the beverage that we received it's this month it is strawberry pie tea. You can get your choice of coffee, tea, or a hot chocolate. And um, I actually switched to tea for a while. So we've been collecting these teas. Um, I say we because um, this book box is kind of something I share with my daughter. So we kind of take turns. Um, if one of us isn't too interested in the selection, usually the other one is. So that kind of benefits us. So this month, um, my daughter was like, that's all you, mom, you, that's your box. She's not such a fan of Anne. Um, unfortunately, I'm trying to win her over, but you know, she hasn't got there yet and um, I'm not gonna give up. But um, yeah, so she kind of chose the tea. So the last three boxes we've been receiving teas and that's such a cute image. I love that image on, on the tea bag or the bag of tea. Okay, so without further ado, let's look at the book. Here it is. It's cloth bound. Isn't that cute? It's so pretty. I love it. When I when I was seeing it through the squiggles, I was like, I can't wait to get to it. But and it has great edges. 
I have a book with spray edges. I hadn't had one before, so I'm so excited about that. Um, it is an illustrated classic, so there's illustrations. Let me see if I can find one. Oh, come on. Let me, oh, I just passed one. Let me see if I can find another one. There's one. There's one. Oh, this is a lovely one. So that's cute. So yes, um, there's little, um, also little ones throughout. Here's one of the straw hats. So that's really neat. Um, there's a book plate at the beginning of the book with a little illustration there. Um, so you can put your name in it. And um, I don't know. Um, I I get nervous about doing that because I don't like my handwriting. But um, you can do that if you want. It's uh, I, you can't. I wish I could tell you, but it 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 uh it's embossed, so that it feels really good under your fingers. Um, there's an illustration there on the front, and um, there's Marilla and Anne and Matthew. And if um you know anything about Anna Green Gables, you know who these people are. But if you don't, this book is about Anna Green Gables, who is an orphan and she is adopted by um, Marilla and Matthew so I mean there's something to this and in I don't want to say any more because I don't want to spoil it for you if you have not read this book and I probably will do a review um, of the book in the future um, I'm gonna reread it I'm looking forward to rereading it I'm a little nervous about touching it so much because it is a cloth uh, bound um, so yeah, I'm a little worried about touching it too much, but it's um, it feels really good to the touch, and um, it's really pretty. I love these red edges; they're so pretty. Um, so yeah, I'm really I'm very happy with this month's selection, and I think if you received it, you will be too, especially if you are an Anne fan. So I kind of wish that she would do um, the other editions um, in the series. I mean, not the other editions, the other books in the series, because I don't own any of those either. So it'd be nice to receive those. Um, there's one more item that should be in this box. Let me see. Let me see. It's the bookmark. So here we go. This is this month's bookmark, and it is a cute little straw hat. And with this really pretty uh, teal teal ribbon, and um, it's attached to like a little wooden um, little wooden I don't know. Um, it looks like a depressor to me, but it's a little uh, wooden um, piece of piece of wood, and uh, that's really cute. So let me put that into the book so we can see how this looks in the book. I don't really want to. I hate when I crack the spine of a book. That's why I'm trying to be very careful. Okay, so there you go. Isn't that cute? Maybe I should have done it on the other side so it doesn't uh, get, you know, get the illustration in the way so you can see it better. So there we go. It is cute. When it's in the book, it's really cute. So I like that. So yeah, there you go. That's this month's uh, unboxing of Coffee in a Classic, the children's box. So I hope you um, liked what you saw. Um, I'm very pleased with this box this month. I'm just really happy to receive this book. And um, so I'll go over again what came in the box. Of course, the Anne of Green Gables cloth bound um, illustrated classic edition um, by, let's see, does it say? It doesn't say who the, but I'm going to see if it has a company in here. Canterbury, Canterbury Classics, um, produced this book, so published this book. And then here is the bookmark. We got the tea, the magnets, those beautiful magnets, the, um, the pink, hot pink tote there we go and that is it was a really good box this month I'm really happy with it so um, I hope you enjoyed this video and again um, if you're interested check out their website um I don't know if um, usually uh, I, I think they have like an Etsy store on Etsy Calvin a classic 
and if they have remaining boxes sometimes they um will show them there um i don't know how popular this box was this month so i don't know if there's any extra ones but i can tell you that next month's selection for the children's um coffee in a classic coffee in a classic book box it's going to be the wind in the willows so, so if you are a fan of mr toad <laughs> which my daughter is so excited for it to come and she can't wait for it to get here. Um, you should check that out definitely and sign up because that is the selection for next month's box. So again, I thank you for joining me for this video. If you enjoyed this video, please hit like and consider subscribing maybe for, um, and coming back for more videos like this. And, um, I thank you for watching and have a great day. And God bless. I'll see you next time. Bye.